So we come back to the Learn German challenge. Today we want to discuss the personal pronouns and uh, before we discuss uh, or we have discussed uh, the nominative uh, the nominative case. So today we want to discuss uh, the accusative accusative uh, case but what do we mean by uh, nominative or accusative cases of the personal pronouns all right so if you say I this is the nominative um, uh, pronoun so I you know it's ish and uh, you is do for example so the accusative so in the accusative this one uh, is for a uh, direct direct object so in this case a pronoun replaces a noun so that you avoid a repetition for example if you say uh, let's say i I have a son. I love him. So if you say I have a son, I love him, this I is the nominative uh, case. So this one is, uh, this is the nominative, uh, nominative uh, case. Then, in this case, because you have mentioned the noun uh, son, so, because you have mentioned the noun son, now you have to replace it with pronoun, so that uh, you avoid um, uh, you avoid uh, repetition. So, in this case, uh, this will be the uh, direct uh, pronoun. So, today we want to discuss uh, these uh, direct uh, pronouns uh, in German. So for us uh, to understand, we'll draw a table with the nominative and the accusative, and we do uh, this example so that it makes uh, sense. All right, let's start. So if we want to start, let me use a, a white subject so that it comes clean. So let me draw uh, this column or this board into two here so in this column I will uh, write uh, the nominative just a quick uh, a quick uh, reminder nominative and here we will do the accusative okay so in this in this column also I will uh, subdivide into a singular and plural okay and here I'll further subdivide into into um, English and I will do, use different friends. So here I will use uh, the German and also in plural it will be uh, let's say the English form and the German form and we will do the same for the other side. So here let's say you are uh, I you that is uh the second person uh this first person second person singular and third person uh singular so he she it so in german this one will be uh ish uh do er 
C S. Okay. So in plural, hi, hi will be we. Uh, you will be you in plural. And he, she, it will be they. And because we have we had uh, done it before, so it will be we is uh, via uh, you here they will be C. Okay. So let's uh, see what we want to discuss today. So we will also have to divide into two. Let's say this way. And we put here a singular. And we also divide. And we. So I have to try and move uh, this one a little bit. So let me let me try and do this way. So singular, okay. So so here will be English, and here will be German, for example. Okay. And so this is singular. Uh, in the plural. So let me move this one a little bit. Uh, so. In plural, so we'll have uh, we'll have in English and in German. Okay. So if you are talking about uh, uh, the direct object pronoun here, hi will be. So let, let, let me divide this way so that uh, it can make lots of sense. So if you are talking of I, it will be me. If you are talking of you, it will remain you. Okay? If you are talking of he, she, it uh, will be he will be him, she will be a, and it will be it. And there is one uh, case in German, so we will not discuss today. Uh, there is you um, uh, official, so we will not uh, touch that on today because it's not in English. All right, but it's important. So me, uh, me will be niche. Okay, you will be dish, him will be in, her will be uh, C. So this one, ah, uh, here, and this one remains the same, it doesn't change. It uh, remains as, like here. Alright, so what about in plural? Me will be. Me will be us. You will remain you. I mean you plural. Uh, him, uh, it will be them. So, what about in German? Us in German uh, will be Huns. Huns. You will be Osh, Osh, Osh. Them will be C. So this C will remain the same as C uh, for they. So we had an example that uh, I, I have. I have a son. I have a son. I love 
him. So him here uh, falls in this uh, column. And if it falls here, so we'll have to use him, okay? So, but first, uh, we need to ask ourselves, this sun is a noun, uh, it's a noun, this sun is a noun, but it's a direct object, so this one is accusative. So if it's accusative, this uh, article will change. So, hi is this one. Uh, this is uh, the nominative personal uh, pronoun. So, I will be, let me use the black pen. So, this one will be, ish, ish, half is, habe, ish, habe, ish, habe, ha. Ha, we, we talk about this one. So this one, because it's um, it's masculine and it's accusative, so it will be uh, einen, okay? Ich habe einen son, okay? Ich habe einen son, ich Ich love uh, liebe ich liebe im will be in good so you can create uh, more examples uh, once you understand uh, it's the position of the pronoun in a sentence so until tomorrow good eh? Nuts. This is good night.